Hi, my name is Justin Healy, and we are on the all-new Valhalla Boatworks V37, built by the Viking Yacht Company. I'm going to do a full walkthrough today, so I hope you enjoy. This boat is equipped with triple 400 Mercury Verados, which is a six cylinder supercharged engine, uh, which provides this boat with a tremendous top end speed as well as a fast and efficient cruise. Uh, we also offer multiple twin or triple configurations between Mercury and Yamaha, as well as all joystick options. The V37 has a 56 gallon live well uh, with an optional clear lid, as well as an aquarium style window for our hardcore live bait crowd. This boat also has optional flip up transom seats, which has been a very, very popular option thus far, being able to have your F facing mezzanine as well as your flip up transom seat. Through our design process, one of the main points is always serviceability with our boats. As you see, there's a big hatch to get into our lazarette and bilge area. We have a very nice polished stainless fuel manifold system can actually pull from any of the three fuel tanks on board to any of the three engines. Next, we have the hooker sea chest live well system, which utilizes a high speed pickup and a single supply hose, generates bubble free seawater, which is very important when sail fishing and or live baiting. Um, rather than having multiple seacocks, pumps for all your washdowns, live well, and to cool your sea keeper, uh, that hooker sea chest live well system comes standard on all the V-Series. Well, if you haven't experienced a sea keeper, you're certainly missing out. We offer an optional SK3, which is integrated into our resin infused structural grid. Rather than losing uh, a tack tackle storage or even a cooler, we've been able to design and engineer it below deck. Uh, and all three of our V-Series boats have been designed and engineered around the weight of the gyro. One standard feature on all V-Series boats is a port side dive door. We have a lift gate here. as well as a door that swings complete 180 degrees for ideal boarding. On the V37, we offer two seating module options. This is the upgraded aft facing mezzanine seat with a row of standard cup holders and rod holders. This also has an insulated cooler as well as Plano trays on the starboard side and tackle drawers on the port side. We have multiple seating arrangements at the helm. We have a standard upholstered bench seat by Costa Marine as well as multiple LeBrock or Release Marine seating options. Shown here is the triple individual chairs, um, 17 and a half inch chairs uh, with two outboard armrests. We also offer two 19 inch chairs uh, with four armrests, all on individual electric slides. At Viking and Valhalla, we go for a less is more mentality. As you see, we have a very clean helm here factory installed Garmin or Simrad packages uh, via this flush mounted uh, black acrylic panel. We also feature a backlit Boca Tech switch panel with all of our lighting on the port side, all of our pumps on the starboard side. We have a standard helm pod, uh, which has, you can do optional faux teak, um, as well as an optional real teak helm pod, which we recommend when getting the uh, release marine helm chairs. We also have a very low profile helm uh, which is very, very nice and, and functional. And we have a port side glove box with our hooker sea chest live well system, variable speed controller, as well as our VHF mic. One of my favorite things about the V-Series boats is the amount of hard top detail that we have. We have flush mounted overhead, spreader and navigation lights, as well as a molded in radar pod for optimal uh, performance when underway. We also provide uh, Gemlux outrigger bases with numerous outrigger pole options. As you see, we have no exposed fasteners on our hardtop supports and only on our main legs. We offer two uh, teaser reel options, one being uh, from our Viking heritage of the drop-down electric teaser reel option, uh, as well as pancake style recessed into the hardtop. In addition, we have a molded in overhead electronics pod, which houses your stereo, autopilot, sea keeper, and VHF radio that allows us to keep our helm and dash as clean as possible. Our console door on the port side is a Panagraph style gas assist uh, with notched out headroom. The gas piston allows the door to stay open when out at sea, 
We also have a uh, handrail uh, to close the door as well as um, help aid you get out of the console. We have a very versatile bunk area uh, which can be used for rod storage or dry storage. We have great access to our electronics and battery rack. Our electrical panel can be reached while standing on the deck. All Viking wire harnesses which are built in-house are color-coded and labeled. We have a standard Dometic electric head and Cori on top uh, with a retractable shower wand. Our console lounge offers great dry storage as well as a standard insulated cooler as well can be plumbed as a live well. Um, and you can also add Gemlux rod holders here to this curb as well as a standard cup holder rod holder. Our bow features optional forward seating. Uh, we have the upgraded Release Marine Teak Ladder Back uh, chairs here. Standard would be just a welded and powder coated uh, seat back, which you see on our Viking fly bridges. Uh, this is the upgraded upholstery option. Um, there's a smooth and textured look, as well as a, a piping, which you can customize to your preference. Uh, we also have a, a recess built in uh, to our seating modules. That way our cushion sits flush and flat. You also see a low profile recess bow rail uh, with no exposed fasteners. We have a hand painted optional faux teak tow rail as well. One of my favorite things about the forward seating modules is not limiting your access to the bow. Uh, we have great access to your anchor locker, uh, bow cleats, as well as does not limit your fish ability uh, when sail fishing or uh, bottom fishing or even casting into a bird play. Moving to our anchor locker. We have a nice big hatch which houses our fortress anchor in a standard uh, fiberglass tube. Uh, we have a standard freshwater hose bib located forward here. Um, and we also offer a through stem windlass option. These pop-up skein chocks were designed exclusively for Valhalla Boatworks uh, when electing for the Fotik option. Our nice big forward fish box offers great capacity as well as access to, to your bow thruster. As you see, we also have a recessed gasket here, as well as an, a, a big lip there for a great seal. Thank you for watching our walkthrough on the all new V37 by Valhalla Boatworks. For more information, visit our website or reach out to sales at valhallaboatworks.com so we can get you in touch with your local authorized dealer.